I bring greetings to you in the mighty name of our Savior and Lord Jesus Christ. What a privilege to come to you once again and to see you that you are doing great and wonderful whatever circumstances you are facing in your life in these difficult seasons and times. Dear brothers and sisters, I can see you by faith that God is working in your life. It doesn't matter. It does not mean anything whatever you feel at this moment because our life as believers in Christ cannot be based on our feelings. Even as I see you now, I see you with the eyes of faith knowing that your destiny will be fulfilled because of Jesus. Jesus came into your life. You have become a believer, a believer who believes in his name. His name is mighty. Every knee shall bow, every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is a King of kings and the Lord of lords. All your sicknesses, all your diseases, all the spiritual battles you're going through right now, the personal battle, the family battle, even the ministry battle, whatever battle you are encountering right now, you are going to triumph over each one of them because of Jesus who is in you. So my dear beloved brothers and sisters, have a heart of cheerfulness. Have a heart of joy. Have a heart full of peace knowing that the God whom you serve, Jesus, will not leave you disappointed. You are not going to remain in where you are right now in the bits and pieces of life that you face all kinds of battles. Because you are not going to be the victim, but you are going to be the victor. You are going to rise up from your ashes. You are going to rise up from your dust. You are going to come out of the storm in your life. You are coming out of the fiery trials you are facing right now. And I want to greet you, dear brothers and sisters in Christ. I want to greet you from the depth of my heart, soul, and life, through the anointing of the Holy Spirit. And I see you to the eyes of faith that you're going to rise up, rise up, rise up to the level and the destiny God has called you. Don't be a person who is fearful, but be a person who is faith filled, filled with the faith of God in your heart, filled with the hope of God in your soul, filled with the Word of God and the power of the Holy Spirit at work in your life. Have faith, have faith, have faith. Have hope, have hope, have hope. Don't you allow anything negative to overcome you. Don't you allow any work of the enemy that he has plotted against you be the ones that will rob you of what God has in store for you. You know, God has a high purpose. God has a high calling on your life. You are not seen by God as a defeated child. You are seen by God even right now as a victorious child. You will come out of the mess you're in. You'll come out of the sickness you're in. You'll come out of all the situation you're facing in your family, in your home, in your job, even for those who are studying in your education. You're coming out, coming out, coming out through all the trials, the fairy trials, and you're going to shine as bright as gold. Beloved, beloved, beloved. So cheer up. Cheer up, cheer up. God is not going to leave you. God is going to bring you out. He's reaching out to you right now by faith in the name of Jesus. 
by faith of Jesus, by faith of Jesus, he is reaching out to you as you reach out to him in faith through the name of Jesus, in faith through the name of Jesus, in faith through the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Spirit, he is reaching out to you to give you faith, to give you hope, to give you encouragement, that through the hearing of this word, you will rise up as a child of God, a child of victory, a child of a person who has already conquered the work of Satan on the cross at Calvary. And when he died on the cross, rose up on the third day, that same resurrection power, according to Romans 8.11, is at work in you right now. So fear not, stay in courage. God will not leave you where you are right now, but he's going to lift you up so that you can rise further and higher to the call of God in your life. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. In Jesus' name. Amen.